Fox News alert on a developing story overseas. Former President Jimmy Carter causing a bit of a ruckus during his trip to the Middle East. Mr. Carty, Carter having an ugly and public falling out with Israel over the situation on the Gaza Strip. Rena Ninen has more from Jerusalem. Rena? Hey, Megan, you know, there aren't a lot of Israeli politicians who are willing to meet with President Carter. In fact, one of three Israeli officials who met with him today blasted the former president, saying the Israeli public views you as a Hamas supporter. The comments came from the Knesset speaker, Reuven Rivlin, who said that Carter uh, blasted him for meeting with Hamas officials in Syria, saying that Israel views Hamas and Hezbollah as satellites of Iran, and also attacked Carter for not being objective enough in his quest for Mideast peace. While in Syria, Carter said Israel needs to lift the Gaza blockade because it's turned into a, quote, prison for Gaza's 1.5 million people. Carter today also visited the East Jerusalem Palestinian visit village of Silwan, which has been a flashpoint for violence in recent weeks. Some of the homes are slated to be demolished to make room for an archaeological park. And Carter told the mayor of Jerusalem today that Israel's treatment of Arab citizens and other minorities is, quote, very disturbing. Tomorrow, he's expected to meet with the deputy Israeli prime minister, Meridor, and also brief diplomats about his trip throughout the Middle East. Megan. All right, Rena, thank you.